$400,000 has been spent here at Milne Bay, so we're looking at upgrades in general right across the facility, major upgrades towards the indoor slide. Uh, there's been a lot of painting that's been done here as well and general refurbishment. Also we've seen the upgrade of some of the amenities, so the change rooms, with a particular uh, focus on some water saving devices in, in those particular change rooms and, uh, and, and as well as uh, all, all other, just, just some general maintenance that's been able to be uh, taken at the moment. And we could probably expect an announcement on when this facility will be open probably by, by the end of the week, but it is most certainly something that, that is on Council's mind right at the moment. We understand the value of the facility, understand how much people wish to use this facility and, and just what it can do in our community. So, so that is something that Council is most certainly working towards at the moment. Under the restrictions, there will be a maximum of 20 people in the facility. Council staff are currently working with, with all the appropriate bodies to ensure that the protocols are met. That's what is of most importance, of course, is health and safety and ensuring that all those protocols are met so that people can come and enjoy this facility and be safe at the same time.